Alrighty, so this video is going to be how to stretch a video that was captured in 4x3 into 16x9. So I was recording with my capture card, um, and my I have my settings for widescreen, and it always captured in 4x3, so everything was always shrunk. And it took me forever to figure out how to get this to fix. So here's how you're gonna get it to fix. So I'm just gonna snap to this point. All right. Um, if I stretch out my view of this, you can see it's widescreen. Well, really, it's not supposed to be. That's after I stretched it. If I maintain the aspect ratio, oh look at that, it's four by three. So how you're gonna fix this is you're going to take your crop. Um, and you're going to fill the screen size with the crop. So right there, I have this bottom piece moved up because my capture card adds a little black bar to the bottom. And I don't know why, but it does. Then you're going to push your, the stretch to fill frame. And if, this, if you don't see this sidebar here, which if you don't, it's this button right here. Um, it's event pan crop properties. Um, so maintain aspect ratio you want to push no and stretch to fill frame yes which will make it fill the entire frame of whatever you have your settings for so I have mine for a widescreen aspect ratio alright and then to get the file to save as an aspect ratio when you push new project when you do file new it'll ask you what to put in there well, if you're capturing with a camera, just the way that cameras in the U.S. film, the best settings to do are, hold up, where is it, properties. The best setting to do is for your width, 872, and for the height, 480. And then you want to do the pis pixel aspect ratio as... NTSC DV widescreen which will make your screen be this these little black bars you see on the side too are just because I have the uh, thing a little bit too big if I shrink it in there you go the bars aren't there see this is what the real image will be once I post this video on YouTube um, but for anything any video that's captured in 4x3 if you really want to make it 16x9 stretch it the reason that I wanted to figure this out was because the video was was already 16x9 but it when I put it onto my computer from my external source my computer squashed it down to 4x3 so everything looked really stretched um, this also works if you're reversing your um, if you want to reverse the pixel ratio if you want to, then you would go File, Properties. You would switch this to what would be, you would keep this the same, the 872 by 480, but then you're going to make your wide, you're going to make your pixel aspect ratio either square or you can make it uh, NTSC DV, which will play on any TV. See, if I make it that, then look, it goes to four by three or if I make it square which is what most multimedia is it goes to this but for wide switching from four by three to widescreen you want to have these as your settings for width and height and you want to make your pixel aspect ratio is NTSC DV widescreen 